Namibia has a small domestic market of 3 million people, requiring SMEs to explore the potential of the export market to scale up their businesses. Mayer, however, stated that one of the major challenges are the different rules and regulations in the international markets, making it difficult for business owners to navigate bureaucracies in foreign countries. He encouraged business owners to do extensive research and engage in networking to make informed decisions when attempting to do cross-border business. We recommend you go on an LSD trip. The acronym LSD denotes uh, look, see and discover or look, see and decide. And so you get a feel of that market. Uh, Whichever sector you're in, in terms of provision of goods and services, go and sniff out what what is the market, what are their packaging requirements, what are their labelling requirements, what are their likes, what are their dislikes. Mayer further emphasised that networking and understanding of operational frameworks in foreign countries are critical to business success. He urged SME owners to leverage bilateral and multilateral agreements, engage with public and private sector platforms, as well as using support from the Ministry of Industrialization and Trade to adopt a strategic export mindset. So a lot has been done. Um, the Ministry of Industrialization and Trade does have an international uh, division which focuses specifically on helping uh, enterprises participate in expos and trade shows in, in neighboring countries. So entrepreneurs who have a, a yearning, they think they're right to, to, to penetrate the export market, make contact with the Ministry Mayer said that Namibia's proactive approach to fostering trade and integration into global markets offers significant opportunities for entrepreneurs.